that's indeed what it was. Now, Methros and Rotwell, in one room, the open room, a bit to a terrible six-heart contract on a 4-3 fifth. It required King Doubleton of Trumps on side and Diamonds 3-3. Three, three. And made it. In the other room, East had to guess whether to play in clubs or diamonds. Six diamonds would make, six hearts would make, and six no trumps would make. However, he had King Jack to nine six of clubs, opposite a known ace of clubs in partner's hand. And he didn't know how many clubs partner had, so he went for six clubs. That was the only slam that didn't make. Clubs were 5-1 again. So that was unbelievably lucky. Oh, unlucky well, for Bulgaria, you may say, yeah. Well, that swung as many as 34 amps then. Yes, yes. You don't want to be in slam. And, you know, once uh, uh, Mac will bid, you, you, you see, then if you stop short of game, say in 4 no trumps or some such, you'll still lose 13, right? So by bidding six slops, you, 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 you only lost. accident happened uh, <laughs> yesterday on the same board in two different matches. I, I, I just <laughs> want to tell you all about it. Now, in one match, in the seniors, your partner doubles the opponents in seven no clubs, and he leads the ace of clubs. And you're looking at the king of clubs and ace king of hearts. That contract didn't make. So <laughs> that was 1100, uh, 1370 at the other table, 20 imps to Sweden against Australia. Now, the very same board, you can make six diamonds and six spades. Uh, now, the Swedish ladies had an accident there. They played in five hearts. With Queen Jack to ten, Queen Jack ten to five of hearts opposite of void. That won the success. So that contract went four down on doubles wisely. So that was 18 imps to Israel. Just just goes to show, uh, John, when things go wrong, they go horribly wrong. The club players would never, ever get to seven no trumps or five hearts. Right. Have you analyzed three spades in the meantime, John? It's your job. Oh, uh, looks I'd like six six losers. I, looks I, like I, they got a little high here. Uh, right. Did they really have to? Uh, I, I mean, it's uh, against the law, isn't it, for 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 North to bid three? Uh, yes, and uh, he certainly had a chance to defeat three hearts. A diamond, a club, two spades, and a heart. 
Mm. The result is in from the other table, three hearts down two. So this is a, a particle swing for USA. What happened, uh, I, my guess is that North led a singleton club and uh, declare with no chance to make, uh, if the finesse didn't work, he took it and suffered too rough, so that was a club and two hearts and two spades and a diamond. All total tricks or trumps, if you like. It's a pretty good guideline, a rule of thumb, that you don't fit to the three level unless you have nine trumps between the hands. It's really good at the two and three level. Loses a little bit of accuracy at uh, higher levels. So let's see if it works here. So they took seven tricks in the other room in hearts. And he will take how many tricks in spades here? Mm. Well, they, they knocked out the club before, uh, the diamond before the ace of clubs was gone, so they're going to get their two diamonds and uh, can't escape the club uh, and spade. Well, let's say this is now he could. That's 14 tricks, he and you have 16 trumps. But then again, the two hearts hearts didn't have, yeah, but the three hearts didn't have to go two down, did it? It was two well after the cl after the yeah. club lead, it, it's going to be normal to go down two because you're going to finesse and suffer two roughs. Exactly, exactly. So there's only one off. Uh, Fifteen tricks, sixteen trumps. So West should have passed two spades, and North should have passed three hearts. There's a lesson to learn here. Right. Um, let's see. Uh, we have Stepanov and Nanev here. They were in the other room in the previous set, but we also have Al Hollander, so he'll explain the system. Virtually all Bulgarian top players play precision. it might make well probably will make yeah. Yeah. yeah turns out with the hearts favorable and gloves 3-2 there's no way to feed it but I think any north-south pair will be doing very well just to get the clubs on this hand oh yes 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 avoiding no trump yes I agree I like two no trumps to be forcing. It's you, you know it's so much better. It's much much easier. But of course uh, you could also play standard where your Norse could be three clubs as forcing, showing that he has four hearts and a longer club suit. That's also playable. 
do you think to know Trump here might have been a uh, relay to three clubs? That's what I think it is. Transfer. Yep. Puppet to three clubs. Now, four spades by Norse would be a big view, wouldn't it? Uh, opposite known four card suit in partner's hand. It wouldn't be natural, obviously, but that would be a big view. But that, that it, again, I mean, if you're heading for five clubs anyway, at least you might as well bid four spades on the way. It looks a little speculative to me. Well, yes, yes, yes. It's ideal when partner has four little spades. Uh, I agree. There are six clubs in the other room. Well, the result is in already. You can look at the auction. Um, everyone, if you look in movie. There's a question here, John. <laughs> Do you think there's a case to deny spades with the south hand? Well, it turns out that it's great to, to deny, but, but in practice, I don't think you should. No, I... I you have to have the hand records to start doing things like that. So now you see how North South got to it in the other room. Now, it was a punt really, wasn't it? Uh, East opened two diamonds, weak with both natures. South doubled. West, west three spades. North bit four spades. South bit four no trumps. And six clubs. That north three spade here shows shortness after having transferred to clubs rather than any kind of spade fit. And this is another case where I think East West would do well to stay out of the auction entirely. Any any information they get the opponents that their spades are good uh, will work to their disadvantage. It's tough though not. Al Hollander is pointing out that the uh, partial eclipse here in the southern part of the U.S., uh, western part of the U.S., starts in about 15 minutes. So I may have trouble seeing the keyboard at some point. That you would be unable to see the keyboard? You, you, you don't have electricity in USA yet, California? Well, it's only a 60% partial eclipse. All oh, right. I'm told he bit four spades, uh, north that is. Well, south did. Right. Why am I always Roland? In Scotland, I'm Roland. R O W L A N D. No one likes my, my real name spelled correctly. Why is that? You know, I get Ronald, and I get Roland, and I get Roland. I never get Roland.
not that obvious. Opposite 1416, Aye. no top. And a four card spade, sir, John. All right. It's a very impressive auction by Bulgaria here. It looks absolutely like they knew what they were doing and describing key features of their hands. And the, at the other table, the U.S. pair had to be guessing a little bit because the, after two diamonds, double three spades, of four make it difficult for the opponents when they have the cards. Don't you need special glasses, by the way, to, to watch uh, at uh, eclipse policy. Oh yes, uh, even even yeah. sunglasses are no good. No, uh, it's you can watch indirectly by punching a a pin, pin hole in a piece of cardboard and uh, and then having a, a piece of paper behind, so you can watch it indirectly. Hmm. So um, two of the matches in the Bermuda Bowl are pretty close. This one and the one between uh, Netherlands and um, New Zealand. Uh, USA two leading uh, uh, by is it 45 I think against uh, Sweden before the last set, uh, and France leads uh, China. New Zealand has certainly been rallied on the last yep. day of the round robin significantly, and then, and then the, certainly they were heavy underdogs against the Netherlands. Absolutely right. Let's see here. So now they're non-vulnerable, and they pay a mini no trump, as far as I know, in this position and vulnerability. So South is too strong for a no trump now. So has to open a diamond. promise any diamonds they will open one diamond if they're del four four void five I don't know how much the rebit shows here but if it is I don't know mm, 13 to 15 Thirteen, sixteen. It's against the odds, really, for Norse uh, to, to bid, isn't it? Uh, especially non-vulnerable. You sort of need a fourteen to sixteen no trump to take another bid. Thirteen to fifteen is you're going to get too many minuses if you bid. If you try for a game. Has upgraded to a strong no top, uh, and then of course uh, a split game. Good fourteen to seventeen. Well, that Looks lead like. helps, um, but is it enough? Well, there's only four losers: uh, spade, two diamonds, and a club. Club, yes. The lead in the other room was a club. That was actually a good lead. Club 
from two s'more. Well done by West. Now the contract can no longer be made after that lead. Oh, East double stamen, yeah, well, <laughs> makes it easier, sorry, of course. Uh, it went 1 0 top to clubs by East. What did you say about doubles, John? You don't like them? Well, I wouldn't double with the East hand, I have to say. Who says clubs? A club would be the best lead for the defense looking at the East hand. Well, you figure to have most of the cards. I, I would, I would go for it. Hmm. I see. Just like one Israeli lady did in the previous set, right? And <coughs> she didn't like it five minutes later because she, she. <laughs> uh, because she was defending two clubs redoubles. Yes, well, I, I doubled two clubs for a lead not too long ago with six to the king. And uh, I managed to take three tricks against two clubs redoubled. Doesn't always have to work, for sure. Well, f finally some luck for B Bulgaria then. Couldn't afford Rockwell here to lead, uh, for leading a spade. It was pretty normal. And I agree with you now. I'm thinking so looking at the East End that he has all the defense. So Thirteen high card points and they are in game. Partner can't have much. The contract is so easy with a spade lead and impossible with a club lead. Spectator tells me, I keep telling folks here that USA 1 and USA 2 will play each other if they both win in the semi-finals. Correct. They will have to play. Besides, they are in the same bracket, so so that's uh, uh, no problem. Now, in the seniors, then they are in opposite brackets. But if they both win, they will still play against each other in the semi-finals. That is mandatory; can't be avoided. So one of the teams will change bracket after the quarter-finals if they both win. But as far as I know, last I saw, they were both behind, although <laughs> one team by one imp and the other team by ten, I think. It's very close in the seniors, apart from one match where Sweden has a big lead against Australia. And you will remember one of the members of the Swedish seniors team, uh, John, I'm sure, Anders Murat, from 1977. Yes, I do. And that also 1977 happened to be the last year that two teams from the same country were allowed to play each other in the finals. It was boring for everybody except the two teams, I fear. Mm. Murat, the inventor or co-inventor of the carrot club, 
Swedish club, if you like. They played it at the time. I don't know if John remembers, but they did. Well, one club at the time was strong, but they changed it some years later to make it two-way. Either 11-13 balanced or any 17 plus out. So here we had a diamond opening bid, feather light with 10 high card points. Knockout double east transfers or shows spades with one heart. West shows a minimum with three spades with one spade. And he says, I don't care. We're playing four spades. won't have a happy ending. King of Diamonds offside, so forget about making it. Just goes to show that sometimes when you have 23 high card points and eight trumps, that's not enough for game. <laughs> it's not always enough for game, that's true. Typical Mackwell game, they don't all make. Oh, maybe John can explain it. Could you please explain why they made the rule about same country in uh, in the final, that that two teams from the same country could no longer play in a final? Well, it's just. Do you remember, John? Yeah. Okay. It's just less less interest to to the rest of the world, and it's unnecessary since they can play in the semifinals. Some Americans would claim, what world? Is there a world outside, you would say? Just kidding. Well, you have something called World Series in baseball. World Series between teams well, we from the USA, right? We do throw Maybe in a... One from Canada. A, yeah. a Canadian team occasionally. The uh, Little League World Series is taking place now in Williamsport, Pennsylvania for kids that are about 12 or 13 years old. And it's really interesting. And they have eight, te eight teams outside of the U.S. and eight teams inside the U.S. And the U.S. teams play to a champion, and, and the rest of the world plays to a champion, and they play a, a title game. And it's fun to see the boundless enthusiasm of the kids and, and actually outstanding play, too. Ah, I see <laughs> how a Grosvenor, I see. Now, Norse switched to the two of clubs. <laughs> and, and, and then you could perhaps have made it if you had let it run to the 10. Mm, but could you really, even if you had known? I don't think so. No, 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 no. No, you can't. You need the diamond for this. Now, regarding the World Series, John, in fairness, it's called the World Series because it was initially sponsored uh, by the World Newspaper. So they managed to stop in three next door. Surprise, surprise. Could there not be this obvious game, the combined 23?
So we looks like we're going to have a, an exact tie after this board. No. Three spades plus, no, 140 plus 100, 246 imps only, right? Or, or did I miss something? I'm sorry, I misread the score. Okay, no problem. Did you talk to Jill, right. by the way, after she was knocked out? Uh,
I haven't heard about it. Oh, in the case of a tie. No, that's true. That the higher ranking team, Robin, has a hidden uh, half imp. So USA has 206.5. So we, ca we can't have extra boards. Oh, sorry. No head-to-head -head results. It's the first tie break. Sorry, sorry. I can't remember who won this match. This is a dull, a very dull six hearts. All you have to do is East, as determined partner, has the two honors that you need, the King of Hearts and the Queen of Spades. Yep. How easy is it to locate the Queen of Spades? The King of Hearts I can understand. But the Queen of Spades. Well, you do have, if you know about the King of Hearts, and there's three hearts, you have very likely three, uh, two entries to dummy, so you would be at worst on a finesse. Yep. You have the deuce of hearts in your hand for the third round heart entry. And, of course, partner could have a useful honor in another suit. Yeah, but you see at the other table, I'm not sure East knew that Pardo had three hearts. One club passed one diamond, and that then East jumped to two hearts, which probably set the suit. So wouldn't West support with any number of hearts? But he did bid a free three hearts, of over the double of two hearts when he didn't have now after the double John certainly the the uh, the location of the Queen of Spades certainly looks like it's in south at this point doesn't it no fear nope this dull slam bit once so far missed four times really have to jump to six hearts. Not that I'd, I'd like to argue with success, but I, I mean they had all the room in the world to, to investigate. But maybe they were unable to locate the Queen of Spades below six hearts. I don't know. Well, the, the redouble of one heart, followed by the immediate two-heart bid over one spade, certainly indicates more than the queen of, uh, more than the king of hearts. So, 
but could it be two other honors? Anyway, Mechstroth bought well with that dummy. The match has been killed, I'm told. Well, it's not over yet. Still have to play ten boards. It's only twenty imps. Twenty-one, you may argue. Ten boards, absolutely doable. Do they have the had the slam lock on their side, I would say, because this this was, a, well maybe it wasn't a gamble, but couldn't partner. You said partner would have more than just the king of hearts, but why did it have to be the queen of spades? So in my well, view, it, it looks like a gamble. No. Two no trumps is the spade race, sound spade race, three or more spades. Some actually distinguish here where they use three diamonds to show three card support and two no trumps to show four. How do you play, John? How do I play my raises after an overcall? My major suit raises after an overcall? Mm hmm A strong raise, yes. Uh, the, the general description is old-fashioned. Old old-fashioned. So is that three diamonds? Oh, three diamonds would be a limit raise or better with some number of trumps, three or four. I haven't graduated using two no trump as an artificial bid yet in this auction, although I suggested it should be played forcing, uh, but yeah. that, that hasn't you, you, found its way into our circle yet. I see. That will change when you turn 60. The same happened to me. Now I like two no trumps to, to, to show four card support. Three diamonds, three card support. There's only three top losers for Declare here, Heart, Spade, and a Club. Oh no, I mean four top, there are four top losers. Mm, but they can't get them all now, can they? How, how do you get all of them? How do you get all four well, how, how do you play? How do you play the hand? Do you, do you play for the king of spades to be offside? I mean, I think the defense is going to play another diamond here. There's nothing, no reason to be attacking any other suit. And now Declare is in his hand. He finesses yeah. in clubs he's not going to make. If he plays a low spade to the queen, But you're never going to finesse in spades. I mean, you ha you have a spade loser no matter what. So, so, so that's not the issue. It's, it's not the spade finesse. There's no finesse. So, so. 
can't can't you just get enough get enough hearts away? Uh, I mean, if you say he continues diamonds and you need a spade up, aren't you just home then? Yes, but but what if South had the king third of spades and North had the king of clubs? You, you want to play a. I guess if North has the king of clubs, you're all right anyway, aren't you? Yeah, that's a double can... dummy lead. Yeah, I see the double dummy lead to defeat the contract. Well, a low diamond, yeah. but. Low diamond, uh, yes. Club, club might do it also. But South can duck the king of clubs here. And that could cause, declare some anxiety at least. What if North guesses to lead a club here? I think a club lead beats it if North can guess that play. Interesting. The Venice Cup, more time penalties by the look, looks of it. Uh, Sweden all of a sudden has a carryover of two imps against Israel. So, I see. Okay. Uh, nothing to the play now. <laughs> no. uh, so, Israel must have been penalised two imps for slow play. Nine. The East-West auction gave away no information about the West hand, so, and South hadn't raised over to no Trump, which I think he might have elected to do, which, well, I think he should with three diamonds and the king of clubs just to get in the way of this uh, of the, of the uh, East-West bidding. But, but on the auction, North was operating completely in the dark here at Trick 2. Yes, he had a safe exit, the King of Diamonds. The ace, rather, he led the king. Now the Claire is not out of the woods yet because he, if he plays well 
two rounds of spades and plays clubs and, and south ducks, he's he's looking at uh, well from his point of view, a couple of potential heart losers. What about a club finesse now? Well, so you so suggest it, ten of clubs so it low, wins. low, low. So it wins. Right, it wins. So what do you do? Good luck. Yes. Well, it's not not at all clear here what the, the best way for declare to proceed. In the other room, uh, after winning the played two rounds of diamonds, then when a spade was led towards dummy, it rose with a king and shifted to the king of hearts, and of course that. That ended the problems for Declare. What does he know about the opponent's hand? Well, Norse must have seven diamonds, uh, and the, the two of diamonds is probably a count signal. So two followed by eight. Diamond seven, three. W what else does he know? That Norse has the king of spades. And Norse has some number of hearts, unknown to everyone except uh, us of course I declare could even try a spade to dummy and lead a little club off the dummy. And uh, when that holds, he can play another club to the ace and rough a club with the ace of spades and go back to dummy. I think maybe I like that play. If spades happen to be, so he can play a spade now to the queen, and if they're 3-2, if they're, if they're 4-1, he has to cash the queen of spades, play to the ace of hearts, and rely on the club suit. But if they're 3-2, he can play for clubs to be 3-2 also by playing a little club to the 10. Mm. That, that only requires clubs 3-2. Three, three now I know the spades are 3-2. It has some danger in that play if North has three spades and a stiff heart. But in that case, he's in trouble anyway. But by playing a spade now to dummy, has he committed to playing on clubs now? No club. Well, not if spades were four one, he could cash the other spade and play a heart to his hand and finesse clubs. But when the spades are three two, now he can simply 
play for clubs 3-2 also. So, so, so what are you saying? You're saying that I he, say he now just plays a hard to lead a little, lead a little club to the well. He's in dummy. Lead a little yeah. club to the ten. If they win it. I have the jack of spades as an entry. I mean, if they win the king of clubs and return a club, the spade is an entry. Hmm, very complex hand. I wouldn't like to defend, I wouldn't like to declare. I think I will take up insurance and five diamonds, John. That 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 is cheap, isn't it? Is that one down, one spade, one heart, one club to lose? Yes, that's with all the all the side kings are winners. reverse a couple of those aces and it wouldn't be so cheap. Has been bit at uh, a few tables I'm told for 200. Many tables when you look at all three categories it's too difficult to defend and there's only one lead to defeat it a full space that is a, a, a low diamond on the go and no one would find that no the after after cashing one spade uh, After cashing one spade, can't you uh, shift? Can't nor shift to a club? Declare obviously can't finesse because a heart comes through. And if he goes up, uh, I guess he, I guess he, I guess he could be all. If Declare would be all right if he goes up and plays the ace and a spade, that's really tough. Ha. So here's a good here's a good reason to well, not, did not expect to not well, to, it's a good reason to to not take the save. Well, I like my line of play better than Rodwell's, but of course, of course I have a little advantage of seeing all the cards. You are saying that they are mortals after all. They can't see through the deck. Good to know. And you know New Zealand has taken the lead now against the Netherlands. Now that would be a Cinderella story if they make it to the semi-finals. Here's the tempting slam contract. Bulgaria stayed out of it, and it uh well, do you really think it's tempting? It needs quite a bit, John well, it would look awfully good if there was just one diamond in the west hand.
But for a start, you need Tom 3 too. So, and you need a lot more than that. But I have that useless, useless king, queen, ten, fifth of diamonds and dummy, and maybe won't find out about it in time. Well, I would think that a number of pairs would get to slam on these cards. So kudos really, to those really who stayed kudos. out. Yeah, it's a great set for the training teams. And they're not all dull three-note trump contracts. Well, that's exactly what the Dutch ladies are doing right now, you know, trying to create swings, and they are indeed. They were far behind, uh, you know, going into the last set, and they are creating swings, but in the opposite direction. And behind by miles now. So China virtually th through in the women's. I would say through 76 ahead with eight to go. Obviously, they are through. Well, I see a way to make slam now. English women mate, bit and mate slam, played by West. And now you can guess why, John. He got the lead of the Ace of Diamonds. Ace of Diamonds would do it, but when they, when uh, East-West cleverly get the play from the East hand, South can't afford to lead either minor. Now, Ace of Diamonds was costly for the Russians. Wow. It's, it's kind of strange, because one would assume it, now England, uh, they don't play strong clubs, so one would assume that the, the bidding went one spade two diamonds by East, right? Why would you leave the ace of diamonds? Hoping the partner had a singleton? There is, actually, if played by East. If you don't get a diamond lead, do you have a chance then? Probably also down on a club lead. Yes, yes, can't make it on a club lead.
is this a reverse transfer? I'm asked to state. Well, I don't know this system in detail, but Al can tell us uh, why West bit the way he did. Uh, Stamen first. Okay, I'm told it's invitational with five states. That's how they do it. One of top uh, was 1416. Oh, that's wow. That's a, that's a fairly common way to use it, I believe, is, here in the States, is that uh, statement followed by two spades is invitational with a five card suit, usually just distributional, not quite enough to make a transfer and then to no Trump bid. Let's see. Well, you have, uh, John, in, in a minute or two. Thanks for, for joining me. I hope I'm I sorry, I have to run. I'd like to no, say no, that it's, it's because okay. I'd like to say it's because I can't see the keyboard because of the eclipse, but actually that's not the reason. So uh, good luck to both teams, and we'll see you tomorrow probably. Thank you, John. Do I have a victim in the audience who can join me? Hmm. It is really demanding. Uh, I did the first two sets today already, so... Hmm. I was planning to, to sit out the set. John came online uh, and told me that he would be available. I forgot he had an appointment. That persuaded me to, to do one more. Of course I can leave whenever I like, I know that. might uh, lock off uh, shortly. There is no, no one in the audience. See David, I don't see Peter, I don't see Phil, mm, I don't see anyone. Well, thank you. Thank you for telling me I'm doing a do good job, but <laughs> I'm not 20 anymore. I, I, I'll tell you that. I'm tired. Well, Buck's mate, John Cook from England, is online, I know. But he tried the other day, and he had no sound. I don't know if it's any better today. He's not in this room, is he? No. He's on my friend's list, so I can't see him.
still hope for Bulgaria, obviously. Mm. Seven boards to go. They need 16 ibs. 15 will not be enough. USA will go through if we have a tie. an opportunity for, for Bulgaria. Four spades. It's much, much too aggressive. Eleven opposite eight high cut points. It's not that the opponents were in any game. Uh, they can't make any. Um, they won three hearts. It went two hearts from east, double by south, three hearts from west and north, four spades. I may get there. Well, probably not. One diamond, double. No re reason to get to four spades. Eight count opposite the partner who is limited to 15 high cut points with this one diamond
Let's see what about this contract. Two clubs, two spades, and one diamond to lose. Should be a hundred super Gary in both rooms and five imps. Yeah, I can see if they have cast their winners, it would have made, but not on the diamond shift. New Zealand up by 15 now, I'm told, against the Netherlands. I don't know after how many boards, though. After nine boards, thank you. So they will still be facing some interesting boards. So it's through nine out of board twenty five, so interesting decisions also in 26, 27, 28 
away. It did go one down in the end. 2021. Is it 1920? Maybe it is. Could be right. You can count eight tricks. In theory, you have more, I know, but you can't take them. So you can count eight tricks, three hearts, three diamonds, and two fates. So you would still have to look at your ninth trick. was a little easier in the other room when the lead was a club to the king. Oh, I see. Yeah, club to the king. So I'll switch to a heart. Uh, declare a one in hand. And uh, cast uh, his ace king of diamonds and overtook the queen of hearts uh, with the king. A and then eventually he could lead a club up while he still had uh, a spade in hand and he had nine tricks now. Why not play four hearts instead, I'm, I'm asked. Well, uh, isn't it normal to get to three note trumps? I mean, you don't have a heart fit. How, how do we know that everything is blocked? Hmm. I think it's pretty normal. Three note trump, I don't think anyone will be in four hearts. Declare in the other room obviously didn't cast the Queen of Diamonds when he was in dummy. He let a club up and there was nothing the defense could do. He had six tricks at the time and he would get Ace King of Spades and Queen of Clubs for nine tricks. Do they know the imp lead? 
seat they had no don't don't know anything until they score up after board 16. West knew exactly well that he wouldn't get to dummy, that the suit would be blocked. How, how does he know that partner has the queen of diamonds rather than the queen of spades? Pray tell. so easy with all cards in view it's just normal to get the three no trumps at the table dummy could have nothing but hearts and nothing but hearts he could consider four hearts he didn't he offered partner a choice of game Not so easy to play. It's a little easier in the other room. A little easier after the club lead. Not sure why Norse didn't lead a spade in the other room. He didn't figure that he would have any any entries to the spades and hoping the partner had some length in clubs. So he decided to, to lead a club rather than a spade honour. West had not shown spades on the auction. He had opened a strong club. Then he had overcalled two spades. Well, it's easy to play with all cards in view. And we can see that he can use South as a stepping stone <laughs> to to the red suit bet winners in, in in the dummy. But the players don't have the hand records. How does he know that South has Ace King Doubleton in club? The double dummy, we would all take 11 tricks, wouldn't we? We would just let the jack of hearts hold and exit in clubs. South can get two clubs and that's all. New Zealand up by 23 with five boards to score. 
If you hear this out, you can type it in the room if you care. New Zealand against uh, Netherlands, the Bermuda Bowl winners from 2011. Not the same team though, only one pair still on that team. Quite a funny story with New Zealand, one of the New Zealand players <laughs> in, the, in the bulletin the other day, he offered his hotel room to one of, of the juniors, cheap, because he was certain that he would go down, oh sorry, go home after the round robin. So from Sunday he wouldn't, wouldn't be in Lyon anymore. <laughs> Uh, that, that that was yesterday. <laughs> then then they advanced <laughs> to the quarterfinals. Now then they even advanced to the semifinals. He has a place to stay now. about space and clocks. He doesn't know anything about diamonds. He knows something about hearts. But I think he will make it automatically as long as he doesn't cash the, the, the Queen of Diamonds. Oh, right, he knows uh, South has six diamonds and four hearts, that's right. And at least one spade. So two unknown cards in the South hand. Yeah, but he doesn't really like to exit in hearts. What, what what if South has a singleton club and a doubleton spade? He, he doesn't want a spade through. But catching the Queen of Diamonds cannot be right, can it? That, then South only needs one club on her. If he catches the Queen of Diamonds, uh, I mean, he will go down every time the South has a, a, a club on her. So that is not going to happen. Would he play Norse to have both club honours? I doubt it. No, he's not going to catch the Queen of Diamonds. Whoa! I spoke the commentator's curse, obviously. That's how they went down in the match between Netherlands and, and New Zealand. The, the Dutch declarer cast the Queen of Diamonds at this point. Yep. Wow. That was very, very expensive. South has nothing but winners.
It's not the new leader made by half an imp. So I'll have to throw a trick. Let me remind you, there's no such thing as a tie. If we have a tie after board 32, USA 1 will uh, advance because they want uh, the head-to-head -head match in the round robin. So they have a hidden half imp, not shown on the scoreboard, because we can't do fractions or decimals uh, on BBO. Well, uh, mm, Victor is not on voice, so he can't hear me. There's no tie. There's no tie break. Hmm, exciting. <laughs> so, one imp in it. Bulgaria need one more imp to win. Mm, someone in your audience did that uh, for me earlier, I think. Uh, I think USA uh, won the head-to-head -head match. Isn't that right? Confirmed. The head-to-head -head match was USA 4.8, Bulgaria 5.2. Mm. I can confirm that the tiebreaker is the winner of the head-to-head -head match. Please don't tell me about scores from the other table. I'm as excited as you are. I know where to look it up if I'm interested. Please don't say anything about boards not played in this room already. Thank you. Yes, if the head-to-head -head match was a tie, 10-10, then the higher-ranked team in the round robin would break the tie, and that would also be USA. May I ask why Netherlands has six in the carryover in their match? Yes, you may. I said it earlier. But I'd like to <laughs> be happy to repeat. It's because uh, there was a time violation by New Zealand uh, yesterday. Late arrival. One player, at least one player. Same happened to Israel. Well, not late arrival, but uh, time violation. Uh, they were slow and they lost two imps. 
you will see that Sweden has a two imp carryover in the Venice Cup against Israel. <laughs> That'd be really, really unlucky. Really late. The other day in the round robin, they were fined two VPs. It didn't matter in the end, but they were fined two VPs for a phone going off. It's their own fault, obviously. Uh, no one else to blame. So it's no carryover penalty. The easiest way of doing it is to add six to uh, the Netherlands score as carryover. Uh, would I bid one diamond with the North hand? I'm asked. Pass, pass, pass. One club, one diamond. No, I don't think I would. Over the strong club. No. Nope. I wouldn't. Doesn't take any room away. If I had a spade suit, it would have been better. But I have too much room if I overcalled one diamond. Looks like tricks and a flat board. Hmm. Let's see what's happening here. Four space double down three. Um, right. Uh, 500 east west can make four hearts. So it's not a disaster, but every imp counts now. In fact, east west can make six hearts or can they maybe not no 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 they can't you can't enjoy the diamonds six diamonds you can make that's right if you get to if you get to slam it has to be six diamonds unless they give you an entry with a club lead but that is unlikely now West will double to show that he has a very sound four heart uh, over court that's just normal and East will pass it so it's just normal Four hearts was normal, double was normal, and east pass is normal. Oh, it's true that uh, 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 if you have six diamonds, you have a problem with spade, spade, where you force uh, a dummy to rock. At ten of diamonds, you could have still have made it. You could rough, then rough with an honor, cast the king, and finesse the ten, if you had the ten.
but you don't. This also looks like a flat board, 500. No, I realize that now that no slab can be made. At this point, it will be France against New Zealand in one semi-final. And of course, uh, USA 1, USA 2 in the other semi-final. As it stands. It's virtually. certain that France that who will advance so this is the only unknown well he has a chance of getting out uh, for two down now he can force West on lead uh, with the king of hearts or any heart for that matter uh, when the jack is in dummy and West has ace queen Oh yeah, he can. And he's going to do that, isn't he? Yep. Well, maybe. Three spades, down two. Doesn't look good for Bulgaria, does it? Then again, they have nine trumps between the hands, so it is possible that East-West will get to the three level as well. Let's see if South opens vulnerable in first seat. Some will open one diamond playing precision, some will not. How aggressive are you? Not that aggressive. Just open with a no trump. And here, now this will probably be a good board for USA because they will stop in two spades. Unless, look here, they never break the transfer. So I think they'll get to three, and I'll tell you why. Because even if South passes, West will beat two spades, and it goes past, past and now South will reopen and then West will be three spades so it could well be the same contract in this room they do not uh, they do not super accept they never break Al told us several times that they never break 
<coughs> out. They never break. It isn't my fault. Al t told me the other day, and we saw it, when Maxtros had five card support for partner Spakes. He did not super accept. I don't take the blame. I blame it on Al. And he's talking about something inferior about Olympiads and stuff. Now come on and take the blame out. Okay, I have witnesses. Witnesses who saw him write that. They never super accept. I'll, I'll, I'll take a screenshot for posterity so I can show Al at my leisure. unless something went that goes horribly wrong for the defense here it will be a flat board uh, six certain losers but you never know they would get to three space anyway that's true as I said if if West had bid two spades, it would go pass, pass, double. And then West would, would, would compete with three spades anyway. I've been very lucky. They never break the transfer. They never break the transfer unless Roland announces that they never break the transfer. They never super accept. I have to remember that. It reminds me in the year not so long ago an Italian lady that gets a Grand Slam in a Grand Slam the only lead to give Grand Slam was a heart away from the king and the kibitzer said, well, a heart away from the king will give the contract. And I said that to the audience, and I said, ha, it's sure. But she will never, ever lead a heart. One second later, we saw a low heart. I remember that clearly. It was South, who had the king of hearts, and some small card, and led a heart into declarer's ace-queen. Thank you very much. <coughs> it's true the North South can make a, a pass going diamonds. So if East West don't get to three spades, uh, North South w w will get to a pass score. But you see that North may choose diamonds unless he bids two no trumps as a scramble to get to the right spot. I think he should. He shouldn't bid three hearts. He should bid two no trumps, scramble. South will bid three clubs, and then North bid three diamonds to show both red suits making sure that they're getting to the, the fit. Uh, yes, compared to, to 
um, to the other board where Rotwell showed an invitational hand with five spades. He had to go through two clubs. Uh, but Maxlos doesn't have an invitational hand here. He has a weak hand, so he would just transfer to his suit and pass whatever partner bids normally to spades. What are you all talking about, Stefano Duff, Duff the Spade? Mm, I, don't, I, I don't know what, what this is all about. Um, isn't it just two down, or did I miss something? I probably did. He's not, he's not a player, is he? Uh, so, it, it's just two down. It's on board 32. First piece of the king, oh well, yeah, you have two certain tricks, whether you win with the ace or not. No, Sarah doesn't have to play a heart, can't he play a heart? Mm. will have to play hard to sell. Right. Wow. And what a board. Can USA gain five imps here? That is what they need. Now let's see. Say they bid to four diamonds, then they get a hundred and thirty, plus the hundred at the other in the other room, that is enough. That is six imps. So Bulgaria must hope that east-west get too high here. But can North-South make a heart contract? And how many hearts can they make? Two hearts is weak with both majors. So, as long as North South bid to four hearts, they are safe. Because even if they bid five diamonds, which is unlikely, uh, at this vulnerability, uh, Bulgaria will advance because five diamonds will go down. It will be played by West, and, and, and North will shift to a club after the King of Hearts. Wow. Now you see. Now here they are on four hearts. He needs to make it. No, 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 he doesn't. 
he can even afford to go one down you see if he goes one down it's 50 teammates lost 100 at the other table that's 150 and that's only four imps he can afford to lose to, to lose four tricks there and still go through only if he goes two down will USA overtake Bulgaria then they will get gain five imps and that is enough what a match I'm glad I stayed I hope you are too not that I stayed but that you decided to stay to watch the finish it's been really really exciting for coming I'll be back tomorrow for the first and third not the second maybe he should have doubled <laughs> well he doesn't know the score Why did East not double four hearts? It wouldn't have helped him. <laughs> because this contract should make. Should. Doesn't mean that it will. <laughs> but why would he double? <laughs> why would you think that you can defeat four hearts? And why would you think that you need to double four hearts? You don't know. Maybe that will give them 590 and just the imps they need to advance. Well, he's playing it carefully. Uh, well, well played he only cast one round of trumps which is uh, good I think he'll make it but as I said go well well done Bulgaria commiserations to USA obviously it's been a great match wonderful for bridge I hope you all enjoyed it even if you are American you will have one team through USA 2 for the semi-finals so Bulgaria will take on an, the other USA 2 team in the semi-finals thanks everyone and see you tomorrow bye for now